All my other siblings were doing really well academically, um, and then at the when I was 16, my mom forced me to go to his uh, one of his seminars, uh, and that's where the Lord touched me. And uh, one of the promises He gave me that day was that He had a plan and a purpose for my life. And I thought to myself, if God can do something with my life, okay, Lord, here it is. You take it. Um, to make a long story short, because we don't have the rest of the night. Um, I went to, <laughs> who told you father is saying who told you uh, I went on to do a bachelor's degree and I majored in history there were about 15,000 students sitting for that exam I stood second from those 15,000 students wow. and then the Lord said there is more I want you to do a master's degree so I went on to do a master's degree got a first class and I thought okay that's enough I don't want to sit for any more exams but the Lord said there is more. And that's when he began to nudge me, not only to do a PhD, but to move all the way to New Zealand to do it. <laughs> and in 2017, uh, in December 2017, I graduated with a doctorate in history from Victoria University. <laughs> And there's another doctor in the room. <laughs> and then the Lord said, it's still not enough. After I'd passed my PhD, uh, the Lord do does amazing things when you obey his word. And it was very hard for me to leave my country, to leave my culture, move to a place where I knew no one. But because I obeyed, um, firstly, I'm here today. <laughs> and I could invite him here. And... Uh, one of my examiners liked my work so much after I had finished, uh, she got in touch with me and said, um, if you want to publish your work, I'm the editor of this series, get in touch with me. So last year, I became a published author with one of the really, really good academic publishers. And um, my book is all about uh, mental health and how the system has not healed itself and so it's, it's unable to heal people. So praise, uh, I praise the Lord for all he has done for me and, and that's why I can't help talking about him. And <laughs>